Yes, we're back. We're back again in ETS 2. We're back again and this time to pick up something rather long. Yep, I've not done a tandem delivery before and thought, well, why not give it a go? Uh, we're in the scanning at 360, which we used in the stream, although it's got the V8 livery on it. We're here in lovely, sunny Oslo and we're going to take a tandem delivery for a short drive. What could possibly go wrong? So grab that guidebook to Scania. And let's go. So hi there, Steve here, and welcome back to ETS2. Yes, welcome back to our lovely Scania uh, 360. Um, truck I used in the stream, if you watched um, Saturday night's uh, stream, where a little bit away from our collection points get a little steering wheel straight be helpful and pick a gear so yeah we're in auto mode i've never driven a tandem before uh, not even in a mod so this is going to be interesting so just wanted to jump in and thought well i'd let you share my first experience on what could be trucking Tuesday. Guessing in here, yeah. Okay, well it's definitely long. And there we go, two trailers. So let's back it up. So whether this thing is going to have the power to pull it, that's the other matter. So we're attached. And that is pretty long. So what we'll do is we'll get rid of that. Uh, a bit of a screenshot of that. There we go. Let's put that back. So 219 miles. Let's reset track IR and make our way. If you're new to my videos, as always, welcome. There's hopefully going to be a new trucking video on the channel every Trucking Tuesday. Something from OMSI the Bus Simulator on a Monday and a Wednesday. Something from Firm Bus the Coach Simulator on Firm Bus Friday. Something from me returning to Twitch on a Saturday night. Something in the form of a game that doesn't normally fit my normal gaming genre uh, on a Sunday, in the form of random Sunday. And um, what could either be flight or farming on a Thursday. So plenty of content from me. Please do hit that subscribe button. Okay. So the 360 only just pulling it. We're doing it. It's a case of getting used to that, that bend. That's the key thing, isn't it? Right, okay. Well, they need fuel at some point. Oh, no, we've got half a tank. Okay. Mercedes man, go. out for the wall ah, we're going it we're doing it that's some right up here Just hope we haven't got to try and park this thing that's the key thing it right, turns okay doing all right so this is the 360 Scania uh, with 30 ton of whatever it is I'm pulling uh, I know a lot of this journey is going to be on the ferry but still looking like we're going to manage it okay I 
In a straight line, Paul just like a normal trailer, I expect that. It's the bends and stuff that we've got coming up here is where it's going to be interesting, I think. Because these slip roads on and off the uh, motorways aren't great at the best of times. Oh no, made it without taking out the lamppost. That's it, you let me out. So yeah, not too bad in a straight line. Yeah, and we're pulling it okay. Pretty much could be doing the speed limit. bad at all not bad at all yeah I just hope when we get the other end we haven't got to reverse it into something because that could be interesting so it's 195 miles to go but I know a percentage of that is going to be on a ferry there we go go for 12 slight labouring but not doing too bad So I'm guessing it's a mod that I would need if I want to pick up more than one of these, but yeah, reversing to get them. So I've got to go down here now, am I? Okay, probably a little bit quick through there. And then around here and onto the ferry. Cornering is not bad as long as you allow for the extra swing of the trailer. Okay, probably eighth was a bit uh, too high a gear to go around there in. exit. So yeah, driving a straight line, absolutely fine. Cornering, no real problem there either. It's the only issue we're going to get, I think, is going to be parking. Frederick's Haven, which is exactly where we're taking the load to. We've got canned beans. Handy now, it's night time. Okay, six was a bit eager. And the journey just around the corner here. Destination. Might even see if we can grab something else. There's another tandem close by. Maybe do another short journey from here. Okay, thankfully the one it parked nice and straight. Hopefully we can do. I 
Or maybe not. Yeah, so we'll skip the parking then. <laughs> Can't even park it straight. Yeah, don't worry about that. Okay, so that went too bad. Let's have a quick look and see if there's something else going from here. And external contracts. What have we got? Uh, back to, oh, there's another one. Let's take that, shall we? Another one. Alborg to Gotteborg. Let's do that. Let's do a second one. Back across the same ferry, I'm guessing. Some motor oil. Okay, so you've got a 56 mile run to go and get our trailer. And I'm guessing come back here and get on the ferry. So we're probably going to need fuel. fuel over there so we're going to get fuel first and then we'll drive and do a second run but yeah I do like my little Scania's I do like as you know if you've seen my videos before I do love an underpowered truck so the smaller the engine the better left here so used to playing in multiplayer with no traffic okay let's go down here then get some fuel at least I know I'll have enough then to finish the journey it does say no entry that side but it doesn't matter okay Shame it's going to be night time though for this one, but. I'm guessing my tank was pretty empty. There we go. Okay, right, off we go. So I'm driving up in full manual mode with the G27 and obviously track IR. Oh, got to look around. Yeah, I do like the Scania. Really, really nice. Right, 56 miles to go. Pick up our load and then bring it all the way back here and across the ferry. Slight bit of speeding on the way, although I can't speak because I'm taking an external contract. Even though I'm on the way to pick it up, uh, pick up the external contract, it won't let me speed. Which is um, yeah, not a bad thing, I suppose. So it shouldn't take us long. There it is, it's on the map already. So yeah, did a first um, ETS2 uh, stream in a while in the previous Saturday, as I said. Um, well worth going back and watching that. Four hours of, well, mayos, mayos? chaos and mayhem. Uh, really, really enjoyable. Been away from streaming for a few weeks, um, but really, really good to get back into it. Great bunch of guys. Few new people uh, joined us. One person joined us uh, during the stream, which is great to see. Always great to have new faces. Going to be a regular event. Every time I play this game, I just forget how awesome it is. Okay, 
game, I forgot to indicate then. Oh, God, that was a bump. Uh, I've probably got 26 miles to go. Still on the map, we've got the round and the big circle here. We've got to pick up our load and come all the way back to where we just came from. Get on the ferry again, I'm guessing. back over this uh, bridge up here. So off at the exit, go around, pick up the load and come back again. Really, really, really enjoy this game. Oh god, well, I need a crash, of course. One can't change gear. Well, he didn't stop and give way, did he? Right, so we'll go through our ball then and back out the other side. Bag lines. Yeah, really like this truck. Really, really like the map. I'm not playing with many mods as well. I don't think I should think I've got any mods in single player mode. Uh, obviously, used to playing in uh, MP where you can't have any. So, pretty much just running the stock game as well in single mode. I haven't even got pro mods uh, installed. I'm just running the stock map. Right, so turn right again up here. And head back out of the town. Six miles away, pick up another second tandem. Uh, just slightly speeding. And drop this tandem off and call it a day then for this video, but we've got to try and get it there first and try and park it this time. See if we can. Just inside the gate is our load. So let's back up to it. Okay, turn the wheel right the other way. See if we can get out of here in one piece. And then run this way. We have round. Okay, 153 miles. Feels slightly heavier this one. Definitely some weight in it this time. A little 
360 struggling a bit now. So back into the town we go. Try not to speed too much this time. Now I've got uh, all this weight on board. Left turn. Yeah, actually, not too bad. You get used to it. You don't actually notice it's back there. Quite interesting to do a longer journey with one. Staying green. It's good, we like that. Yeah, limited really by the power of the truck or lack of power of the truck. But it does it. Not like anything, this 360 will pull anything. Good little workhorse. We need 750 brake, gang. Okay? Not a lot of traffic around, which is quite good. Fairly bouncy about back there. I'm really taking this at night and not during the day. Alright, so back to where we came from. I'm guessing back on the same ferry. But yeah, it pulls it okay. Corners aren't too bad. In case you get used to the length. The double articulation, but um, straight line, obviously, you don't notice it at all. It's just limited by the power of this truck that's slowing me down. off here. Just got to keep an eye on that mirror now. No, corner's perfectly okay. It's just the hills, this thing has got no power. That car with one headlight working. That's quite cool if that is. And I think that's the way the actual, because that truck looked like only had one working as well. I think it's just the way the headlight is facing me. Look, we're on the road E45. How apt, if any of you watch my streams. Okay, try to go for 10th. But yeah, the, uh, the 
tandem trailer, quite like them. Not bad at all. Okay, so we're going back into Frederick's Haven. 100 miles to go. Slightly speeding. Didn't like putting off in. Didn't like putting off in fourth. Only that's green. Only just like second. Yeah, it's looking rather nice. Does look quite. Just getting used to having that longer. It's a normal trailer with another trailer on the end. You see when they're not allowed in the UK. That's pretty long. Have she got my main headlights on? Yeah. Port we go. Bay number two. Uh, so where are we going? Got a boat. Where else? It. So it shouldn't be far away now. <laughs> yeah, don't blame fourth. Doesn't like it. Yeah, 36 miles. Okay, so out of here we go. Yeah. Is it out of here? No, it's not out of here. It's back out of that there. Okay, we'll test the turning capabilities of it then. It turns okay. So we'll go down here then. Lights on green. We like green. We made it round. I don't know if we make it up this hill, mind, but we made it round. Fourth gear for the win. Yeah, not the trailer that's limiting me here. It's the power of the truck. Where are we getting there? Thirty-two miles to go. Lights went out. Alright, it's so up onto the main highway, I'm guessing. Oh, 
Oh, I do like this game. Try it. If you're used to playing ETS 2 and you're always driving really high-powered trucks, try taking an external contract job in a really low-powered truck. And with a, if you've got a G27 or you're using a manual gearbox, just tell me it doesn't make the game better. Because you can't rush anywhere. You've got to take your time. You've got to think about gear changes. It makes such a difference. even there it's you know about to struggle then to get over that bridge to do 50 miles an hour on a flat you know this thing copes perfectly and obviously because I'm speed limited because it's an external contract once you get to 55 it's fine oh pick a lane right drop off is just up here hopefully it's an easier one of the wiper sounds so nice and the sound of the rain on the roof and the sound of my truck nearly stalling okay around we go Slightly a bit too wide there. Yeah, I really enjoyed putting these doubles. It does make you think a bit more on the bends and other junctions than pulling a standard trailer. Yeah, if you want to see more trucking videos from me, uh, I know I went through the Scania um, truck driving uh, sim. I'll certainly come back and do some more of those. But if you want to see some more standard uh, trucking videos from me, please do let me know. I'm guessing it's in here. Somewhere. Where do you want this load? Out there. Yeah, really enjoyed enjoy doing ETS2. Obviously, we're going to do some more trucking on the stream. If you want to see more other videos from me, yeah, let me know. Please leave a comment below. Oh, damn it. There we go. And parked it. Yay. There we go then. Job, as they say, is done. Yeah, so it's rather than just do one video for this one, I thought I'd do a couple. Um, so I think we trailer. Uh, there we go. There we go. If you want to see more videos, please do leave a comment below. Um, and yeah, do please uh, subscribe to see more of my other videos. There's uh, OMSI, there's Fernbus, there's going to be Flight soon, and some random other stuff as well. And do please check out the Google Plus page if you haven't. A great and growing community of like-minded sim gaming fans. And also follow me on um, Twitter, uh, at Steve Chess, and recently um, Instagram, under sims.and.stuff. Some random pictures on there from me. That's it then. I um, really enjoyed pulling those tandems. Certainly want to do some more of that. Um, yeah, and I want to do some more trucking. Maybe try tandems in America um, next. That's it. I'll be out this rain. Until the next time, if you have been, thanks very, very much for watching.